So this question looks like it's going to be a translate word problem question. I say that because of the length of the question. Typically translate word problem questions are four or more, so four plus lines long. So the rule with, uh, with long word problems like this is that we don't want to read the entire thing all in one go. We want to stop at the end of each sentence, make sure we understand what we've read, and definitely write down any quantitative information. So the question says the monthly membership fee for an online television and movie service is nine dollars and eighty cents. So I'm gonna write that down. Monthly equals nine eighty. The cost of viewing television shows online is included in the membership fee, but there is an additional fee of a dollar fifty to rent each movie online. So rent. So movie. Rental equals a dollar fifty per movie. This is per month, obviously. And for one month, Jill's membership and movie rental fees were twelve dollars and eighty cents. So her membership, we'll call M, right? So we'll call this M. Let's call this R. So her membership M plus her movie rental, which I'm calling R, was equal to twelve dollars and 80 cents and the truth is m we know is nine dollars and 80 cents so i can just replace that m with that her rental we don't know how many movies she rented so i'm going to say that, that is uh 1.5 or dollar 50 times r right because if she rented one movie then it's just 150 times one if she rented 10 movies it'd be a dollar 50 times 10. so all that together is equal to this 12 dollars and 80 cents Right, so I'm translating the question as I go. So all of this entire equation just came out of what I just read. So the last sentence says, how many movies did Jill rent online that month? So basically, what is the value of R? So to do this, I'm going to isolate R by subtracting $9.80 from both sides of the equation. By doing that, my 980 crosses out on the left side. I have one 50 times R is equal to 1280 minus 980, which this is the calculator section if you need to use your calculator. If not, we can say this is just equal to $3. And then I divide by 150 on both sides, and I get R is equal to 2. So she rented two movies, and therefore the answer is choice B.